How's it going everybody? It is I, Red64 here, and welcome to another Stardew Valley video. Last time we acquired this little thing, the crafting bench. And, you know, I also crafted a chest. Let us know which color shall we pick down in the comments below. Also, if you're new here, please consider, consider leaving a like, subscribe, and let me know what other game would you like to see me record on the channel. It can be any game you want, so let me down below. Is there any games that you'd like to see me record or play or even stream? So definitely let me know, let me know down in the comments, and uh, yeah, leave a like and subscribe. And let's start this little marvelous journey. So I did get a quest that we need to craft a scarecrow and here it is Boop. i wanted to do that together with you all so there we have it I'm gonna put the rest of the fiber in there go outside and i'm gonna place this bad boy right around here sure why not I don't really have anything to sell though. So I did get a suggestion last time that uh, we go and check out the mines, which I'll definitely go and check out right now. Again, thank you for whoever commented that the suggestion. Also, if you have any other suggestions, please leave a comment. Don't be shy. Okay, so our goal today is going to be buying a backpack upgrade. And for that, we need 2,000 coins. Unfortunately, we spent all of our money on the crafting bench last time. But at least now with the crafting bench, we can craft things like chests and that type of stuff. So I think we made a good decision for buying the crafting bench but today we are going to buy the epic backpack okay a leak uh hello lewis oh hi there oh pardon lewis has zarbon voice what an eyesore This is the Pelican Town Community Center, or what was left of it anyways. It used to be the pride and joy of the town, always bustling with activity. Now, just look at it, it's shameful. These days, the young folk would rather sit in front of the TV than engage with the community. But listen to me, I sound like an old fool. Joji Corporation has been hounding me to sell them the land so they can turn it into a warehouse. Pelican Town could use the money, but there's something stopping me from selling it. I guess old-timers like me get attached to relics of the past. Ah, well. If anyone else buys a JoJo Co. membership, I'm just gonna go ahead and sell it. Ah, uh, here, let's go inside. Alright, Gramps, let's go inside. And for y'all wondering, no, we're not buying the JoJo Co. membership. We are keeping this dusty old relic. Hmm, what's this? I guess Vincent and Jess must have been playing in here. This place is even more dilapidated than I remember. What? It's an alien! Ghosts! Gremlins! Goblins! What's the matter? Are you ill? Yes, mentally. Very much so. 
I can see demons. You saw something? Hmm. I wouldn't be surprised if this place was full of rats. I forgot to take my medication, Doc. Sorry. You're worrying me, Axe. I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry. I didn't take my pills this morning. I forgot, okay? Look, I think I'm going to head home. I need some lunch. Hey, I'll keep this place unlocked from now on. Maybe you can uh, help catch that rat if you have some extra time. Blood said rat. Strange? Yes. I'll have to come back and explore this building further. Yes. For the epic missions that they give. Let me switch to the axe so I don't carry around a leak all the time. Hello, ghosts, gremlins, and goblins. We have something here written in... I don't know. Can't really say I understand in what language is that written. There's a bulletin board. There's nothing I can do. But yeah, here later on we'll be getting some uh, quests that will need completing. So yeah, that's the fun, I guess. Also, I did want to head out to the mine, but I am... Um, uh, my inventory is a little bit full. So let me go around and give these away as presents. Aren't you cold? They don't make sweaters like they used to. <sighs> cool, I guess. Where's Granny? Let's meet Granny. It's nice to be close to the ocean. The sound of the sea makes going to sleep a lot easier. As kids, we hunted for seashells after the tide went out. Those were the days. Sure. Sure thing, Grandma. Buying one amethyst at three times the market value? Please deliver directly into my hands, Sebastian. I mean, cool. I don't know. I guess we're gonna... We are heading to the mine, so I guess. Hello. Okay, goodbye. Click, click. Don't go into the room. Damn it. They, they, they really went into the room. They, they... Now I can't access them. Uh, hello, Judy. You don't like anything I give you. You suck. Okay, I guess I'll sell these and I'll keep the leak. I guess I have some little wood left over, which I'm gonna just scrap, place this here, and let's head to the good old mines. And let's see what can we, what treasures can we find there? Moving in the ground, moving in the ground. Let's -a go. Man, I can't wait to buy a horse. No. Maybe when we come back. Yeah, here's Robin's place. If y'all remember, we went to Robin's place last episode. To collect our brand new crafting bench. Hello? I was just peering down into this old mine shaft. It's been abandoned for decades. Still, there's probably good ore down there. But a dark place, I'm 
distributed for so long, raised or is the only thing you'll find. Here, take this. You might need it. Hooray! We got a jagged knife! Thanks, Gramp Gramp. Gramp's so nice. And here we are in the mine. And <laughs> the first strike we get is a... Um, how is it called? A ladder. So we can go down further. How nice. Okay, let's quickly could give. Let's quickly get everything. And we will keep the geodes this time. We won't sell them. I am probably going to go and open them up. But I mean, I'm kind of trying to make money, not spend money. So I'm kind of like thinking about that. Should I? But oh well. Okay, we're already a little bit low on energy. Let's eat the leak. We should have probably gone, got some food, but oh well. I came, I came a wee bit unprepared, but that's fine. My current quest is to get some geodes and to mine it up, to get them opened up, because we might find something valuable in them. Die, monster, you don't belong in this world. How about... Hey, don't run, don't you run for... If God wanted you to live, he would have not have created me. Also, ow. Eat the leek. Eat the leek. And we got some slime. Uh, we will need coal eventually. But coal is pretty common, so I'm gonna... I'm gonna take the quartz, goddammit. Okay, he took the quartz. And I'll see for us to leave the mine at around like 6 maybe. Because remember, if we stay up way too long or if our energy is depleted, our character will faint. And not only will we probably lose some items that we have, it will also cost us a nice bit of money. And money is something that we're currently looking forward to uh, collect. Uh, okay, so I'm gonna do a little strategic move. I'm just gonna take this. I'm gonna eat the carrot cave. And take that back. Little genius move. There's the earth geode as well. But we can't take everything. For now. For now. So unfortunately we will have to leave it. Although I don't know. Do I really need this much stone? I'm gonna definitely be collecting copper so that we can upgrade our tools. Uh, but it kind of sucks that we are very limited with our... Uh, we are very limited with our stamina and with our backpack space, so not only do we not have much time to explore, but we also kind of get a little bit stuck. Because we can't take everything we need. Oh, 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 okay, 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 there's another one, there's another one. Okay, so this does save us a wee bit of time. Yum. Okay, pro move. It didn't give us a lot of energy, but I think it'll be just enough to survive. Okay, I'm gonna just dig up the copper. And remember, we kinda do need enough energy to go back home as is, so, you know, that kinda sucks. I should have probably taken that hardwood as well. Ooh, my. But... <laughs> Ow. No, no, slime. I do not have enough help for you. Dude, turn, turn around. God damn, bro. And the slime is good. And also, there's another Earth Geode. Well, I mean, I guess they aren't that rare since they appear all the time, so... Let's leave the mine for now. 
and let's head back home. And hopefully we stumble upon some food. That would be very nice. Hello. I hope Demetrius doesn't blow the house up with those exper science experiments of his. I'm not even sure what he's working on. I think it has something to do with plants. It's good to make it's good to take a break from work every now and then. I guess that's kind of difficult when you live on a farm though. Hey, at least in the winter you don't have to worry about crops. I mean to be fair, my guy, you do have a point. Now do I eat this or do I give it to Caroline? I'll probably give it to Caroline because I think we can we can definitely make it home. Oh, 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 oh. Actually, Caroline is here. I was thinking about going home and leaving some of my items behind. But Caroline is here. So let me dump the rocks on the ground. Pick this up. If anything for my girl Caroline. If those rocks despawn. I am going to be a little sad because I... I'm planning on selling them all, and Caroline is gone, of course she is. <sighs> Damn it, Caroline. I, I turned my back for like two seconds. This is, this is why we don't simp, guys, okay? This is why simping doesn't work. And she goes into her room. God damn it, Caroline. <laughs> Well, that sure does suck. Get out of there. Get out of there. Fine. I'm just gonna eat it then. It did nothing. Okay, that surprised me a little. I wonder did my rocks despawn? I know I'm going back for stones, but... I could sell them for some good money. And yep, they're here. Okay, that, that's actually quite a relief. We're kind of low on energy. And this is one of our first nights out in Stardew. That's very nice. Okay, so in tomorrow's day, what I am planning is I'm going to go and process these geodes and then we're gonna hit the mines back again. And I'll see to buy some more crops, because I think my potatoes are pretty close to being um, grown fully, so that should be something. Okay, stone goes here, slime goes here. I'm gonna put two pieces of quartz there, because I want to give the... I want to give one piece to the uh, museum, and I'm gonna leave that there because we are going to need um, the copper for later and yes go sleep the night and we got level 2 foraging and we got a survival burger recipe we got level 1 mining pickaxe proficiency a new crafting recipe a cherry bomb nice okay we didn't make a lot of money but that's okay we're gonna go out straight to the mines. Uh, oh, hold on. As you gain experience, you'll discover new crafting recipes to increase profit and make life easier. A scarecrow, for example, will prevent crows from snacking on precious crops. And we got 100 bucks. Uh, hi there. Good morning. I noticed that you've been breaking some rocks open and finding ore. That's good. If you want to get the most out of the ores you find, you'll need a furnace. Just so happens I had an extra set of blueprints lying around. Here, I want you to have them. Hey, and he gave us a blueprint for a furnace. Very nice. We learned how to craft a furnace. Okay, that's actually pretty cool. The furnace allows you to smelt metal bars. The bars can be used for crafting, construction, and tool upgrades. 
When you've smelted a few copper bars, consider having me upgrade one of your tools. It can make your work a lot easier. Well, okay, I'm heading home. Take it easy. Thank you. I was actually heading to your home, but... Well, my sources tell me you've been poking around inside the old community center. Why don't you pay me a visit? My chambers are west of the forest lake. The stone tower. I may have information concerning your... Rat problem. Marasmus the wizard. What's this? Robin here. I know there's a lot of stones scattered around your farm. If you have a surplus, you might consider having me build a well for you. Wells can be placed all over your farm and serve as a convenient place to refill your watering can. Just swing by my shop with 75 stones and 1000 gold when you're ready for it. Robin, we have three pieces of mail. Dear Farmer Ice. I'd like to apologize for joking about your grandpa's old cottage when we first met. It's really a nice little house. However, you might need some more space someday. That's where I can help. If you bring me some raw materials and pay a fee, I can expand your house. The first expansion I offer includes a kitchen. With a kitchen, you'll be able to cook any recipes you've learned. Anyways, I hope you're starting to feel at home in Stardew Valley. Your local carpenter, Robin. Thanks, Robin. I don't really think that we need a well because we already have a very stable source of water right here, but that's cool. We might get one. For shits and giggles, I guess. Okay, I am gladly gonna take the leak. Now we're gonna go visit our buddy old pal, the man to work our ore, and we need to see Gunter. Because I have a little gift for him. Right here. The board score. How nice of me. How very, very nice. Oh, here. And there's a daffodil. Which we will definitely collect when we come back. And give to Caroline. So we can be good enough friends. So I can finally enter her room. Like, damn it, Caroline. Alright, I've got you all of work. Oh, you work since 8. Okay, that's actually good. Here works from. I got an earth crystal from the trash can. I am going to return this to the man. I'm expecting to find some ore in that man's place. Well, th that was oddly convenient. I mean, I, I guess I'm gonna give it back to you. Donate to the museum, yes. Earth crystal and quartz. There you go, buddy. That that's about it. I I returned your trash to you. You work since nine, damn it. Why don't you why don't you like Gunter and just work? Well fine, I guess. Actually. I'm gonna go and collect that daff da da daffodil and give it to Caroline. And there's Penny. Hello, little Miss Penny. Do you want a leak? Thank you. This looks special. Oh, she likes leaks. Really? The raindrops are really loud on the metal roof of our tree. It's soothing them. Well, hey, at, at, at least, at least that's a plus. At least that is a big plus. Where did I find the daffodil? It was right here. Now I'm gonna go give it to Caroline. And we are gonna go have our ore processed. And we are going to the mines. Again. Oh, and this is some quality daffodil. Hello, Abigail. I am here to see your mother. Oh goodness, are you sure? Positive. Actually, as a matter of fact, let me see. We have no cards with anybody. Not even Caroline. Damn. My garden is happy today. And our water bill will be lower this month. 
Bruh. The valley looks more interesting in the rain, don't you think? Yeah, yeah. I agree. Man, shame I couldn't snuff out their play. But oh. It, it would be a little epic trolling. And then, uh, man, it sucks that Gus, the Gus works from 12. Because at the early stage, you know, I still don't have my house upgraded. I don't have a kitchen. I need to buy food. Hello, sir. I want to process geodes. Okay, 25. Oh, this is going to be a little bit pricey. But... We could have our price potentially be covered. Earth crystal and the final one is three coal. That was a load of trash. Literally, what did you just give me, my guy? That was a very big load of trash. Oh my god. I, I... I don't know how to react to this. We literally got mud and a couple of rocks. We really wasted 100 gold on trash. Well, at least I'm gonna sell it. Also, real quick, I'm gonna go inside the house. And I wanna check real quick what we need. We need 20 copper ore for a furnace. So we still need a lot of copper. But now it's a little late to go to the mines though. Okay, you know what? Today I'm gonna go and buy some seeds. And I'm gonna plant some of them. And then we're gonna hit, hit the mine again. I think that's pretty okay idea. Also, Gus is open now. Seeds for sale. I know that's why I'm here. Grass recipe, rice oil vinegar. That's really some pretty cool um stuff. Huh? Neat. Uh, honestly, my, one of my main goals is I want to buy one of the fruit trees. That's something that I'm really looking forward to. They are a little bit pricey though, but I think that's fine. I'm gonna buy like 10, 10 more of these. And I know that I just... My goal is to get the backpack. But I think, you know, we still have to work on our farm a little bit. And... The profit is gonna come in eventually. We just need to wait. We need to be patient and wait and plant our potatoes and then sell them to McDonald's. Let me just get my hoe out, no pun intended. There we go. And then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And that was a perfect. That was literal perfection. Now, since it is kind of like one, I think it's a little bit late to go out and explore the mine. So, I'm not gonna skip this day. I'm gonna collect a little bit of these, like, trees. Clear the way out of here first. Now, I'm gonna probably sell them. Which is, you know, fair enough. We do need a lot of money, that backpack expansion sure is very, very, and I mean very pricey. So we will collect a lot of these. Also, there's a cave inside here. It's currently empty. I'm probably, I'm thinking about, should I get mushrooms? Okay, you know what? For all of you, what should a question for all of you should we of course if you manage to get this far into the video you are a certified giga chad and i'm genuinely gonna ask should we when we get the offer for the cave shall we grow mushrooms in there 
or shall we grow out the fruits? That is something that I would like to know your opinion about. And we collected a little bit of trees. We collect. We're gonna collect a little bit of stone. And then we are going to piss off back into our little house. We did put a lot of things for sale though today. So that's good. And then tomorrow on, early in the morning, we are... Oh, here, we got a geode. Cool. So we are gonna straight up go to the mines and explore them a little bit more. We also got a full cool sword, so that's nice. We can also buy weapons, but we can also find them, so I don't think that's yet as important. So let's go to bed real quick. Honestly, that is a very, very, very low amount of money. We didn't even get to level up anything. Potatoes are still growing, so I'm just gonna water my plants. Unfortunately, I don't have any food to refill our energy. And as you can see, our activities are taking quite a lot of energy already. Like, we just basically started and I am also low on energy. Yeah, sure, let's water the scarecrow. That's always important. So I guess if we will just have to look for items around the place, I guess. Leaks are our best bet. I mean, we, we have daffodils, but I don't think they restore stamina. So we specifically need leaks. What is this? I'm looking for someone to bring me 25 copper ores to aid in the... Okay, you know what? Since we're going to the mine, I think this really works in our favor. Oh, thank god, cookies. Okay, so these guys throw away cookies in the trash for whatever reason. This guy sometimes rarely throws out, you know, actual meals. But hey, now with cookies, we have a better chance at survival. That is, I'm not concerned about our HP, I'm more concerned about our energy. Because if we run out of energy or something, then it, it's just gonna suck. For the reason that... Oh look, there's a leak as well. I'm just gonna eat this, I'm gonna eat the wild horseradish. Re regain all these bit of stamina. I'm gonna eat the leek. Regain a little, a lot of bit of stamina. So leeks are actually pretty good. Let's say hi to Linus. Hello, Linus. Okay, goodbye, Linus. Damn. Her really said, "Did you come here to ridicule me?" No. What is wrong with you? Okay, let's go back to the dark, deep mine. And my goal now is, again, obviously, collect copper. We got a freaking diamond! Let's go! Diamonds! Heck yeah! <laughs> oh shit! I didn't even know that! And I've been playing this game for like so long. Okay, that's actually pretty cool, not gonna lie. I'm gonna discard all the coal that I have because I do want to collect slimes and I want to um, level up my combat abilities as much as I can. Did he just drop green algae? That's actually pretty cool. Because we can use that to regenerate our stamina. Okay, now let's just dig for the staircase. And there's another slime that we can get. That's very nice. I really, really want to level up my uh, fighting abilities. Come on, slime. Don't be shy. And he gave us a staircase. Wow, we, we are getting lucky in the mines. Nice. 
Don't you dare. Okay, he, you dare. You are a good warrior, Mr. Slime. K kudos to you, I guess. Pick that up. Okay, collect some of these rocks. I have to organize my hotbar a little bit. But that's fine. Okay, we got the carrot thingy. Oh, we got a circus already? Nice. Okay, we got a lot of slimes now, which isn't good, really. Just, just get him. Just, just get him. There's a lot of, there's a plenty of quartz down here. And I'm gonna eat the cookie. And take back our stamina, because we were already getting really low. Let me take this. Get my sword out. Wood, we don't really need. Ooh, bug meat. Oh man, I don't have any free space. I would like to take the bug meat though, because we can craft delicious burgers from the bug meat. And now, again, we are looking for a staircase. Actually, wait, there's a staircase over there. I'm a big dum dum. Guess I wasn't paying much attention. But damn, we got diamonds? Okay, that was lucky. Yeah, land those crit shots. Land those crit shots. Okay, good, good, good. Dig up all of the copper, because we, we kind of need it. Okay, now the geo, but it's only one geo, so it's like... We can afford to ditch the regular geode. We got a freaking diamond. Now a diamond would probably cost a lot. But on the other hand, and you know what? No, actually I'm not gonna sell the diamond for now because I'm gonna keep it as a treasure. It's our first diamond that we got in this game. And at the fir very first level, like, we got so freaking lucky. Ow, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's talk about this, let's not be rash. Uh, okay, okay, since he dropped that, um, give me your algae, and I'm gonna eat the green algae, because green algae is actually pretty yummy. It gives back energy. Granted, not a lot of energy, but energy is energy. Now today is a little bit of a longer episode. Now, if you all are wondering why am I not cutting and editing these Stardew Valley videos, I honestly don't because I really enjoy just, you know, the gameplay and just having fun with everybody. Kind of, ju just having a good time. Like, it's kind of like streaming. But not going live, like essentially like th that's just it. So I enjoy it, I play the game that I love, and, you know, uploading it for the community that I love, and that's really about it. Obviously, we will have some videos later on. Oh, nice. Okay, I'm gonna dig up this copper, because we need 25 pieces, and we're not even close. Okay, fine, maybe we are a little bit close. We do have some at home, though. Ow. Damn you, Diglett. Yeah, we do have some at home, though, but... Oh, well, what can be done? And we got the elevator, nice. We did get it, like, a little ages ago, but I just, you know, I just talked about it. We can also go over there to the little adventurer's guild thing, where we can buy different weapons. I think I'm gonna stick with the rusty sword for now, because I really want to buy that backpack upgrade. So, after the backpack upgrade, maybe then, you know... I mean, in the mines, we are gonna find different weapons by ourselves. But still, maybe if we wanna be better, I guess. Or get through the mines a little easier, we can definitely... We can definitely use a more powerful weapon. Hello. Yep, I know. Do you want a crystal? Cool. 
Well, she likes crystals. That's nice. Hello, Haley. You don't get shit. Goodbye. Please don't come to my farm. We got a diamond. God, I, I still can't believe we actually pulled a diamond. I'm gonna sell everything except the um, except the ore. Yep, 26, it's perfect. We're gonna get 200 gold coins for it from our Geo dude. I hope he doesn't close on us. Uh, how much gathering? Okay, we got two days. Hmm, do I go now? Because I'm afraid he will close up. But like, oh well. Yeah, sure, let's go now. Maybe he won't close. Because I don't know, like, they do have, like, closing times as well. So I don't want to risk it and just waste my energy. Because energy conservation here is really important in this game. Also, this is a bit longer episode. Okay, at least we got to hit the mines. Yep. He's been closed for a while. Well done. Thank you all so much for watching. If you're new here, please leave a like, subscribe, and if we can hit six likes, we're gonna make another episode. Peace.